Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be doing a bar inspired strength workout using a set of weights. I'm gonna be using five pounds today. Feel free to work with whatever you are comfortable with. Maybe roll out a yoga mat for your comfort and we'll go ahead and get started. This workout will take around 20 minutes or so. So it'll be super quick, but super effective as always. Let's get warmed up. Breath in, reach your arms out and up. Big circle, big stretch. Exhale, release, back down, two more, breath in. Exhale, one more, inhale. This time, as you exhale, fold all the way forward. Go ahead and take your right fingertips outside of your left ankle. Reach your left fingertips high, finding a gentle twist. Beautiful, go ahead and release out, switching sides, taking your left hand to your right ankle, reaching those right fingertips high, breathing into your twist. Go ahead and release, this time take both fingertips, interlace your hands, and then reach your arms away from the body, letting your head and neck fully relax. Big stretch to the front of your shoulders. Go ahead and release. Framing your front foot to the top of your mat, plant your palms and then step into a downward facing dog, pedal out through the feet. Good. From here, go ahead and step your right foot forward so your left leg is back. And we'll come all the way up to standing. Finding a lunge, reach your left arm overhead, lower your back knee, and then step it back up. Left foot steps back, lunge. Little bit of a cross body twist, come back up. Lower down. One more. Go ahead and switch this time, left foot forward, right leg back. Reaching your right fingertips across. Lift back up, three more. Good, feeling this side body open. Last one here. This time lower to your back knee, frame your front foot, and then stepping back into a tabletop position, cat cow breath in, lower the belly, lift the gaze. Press the floor away, round out through the back. Good, two more. Find your downward facing dog when you're ready, tucking the toes, pressing the hips high. From here, walking your feet up, rolling all the way up to standing. The crown of your head is the last thing to arrive. Breath in, reach your arms out and up, and release. Go ahead and grab your weights. We're just gonna start with one and then we'll work into both weights here in just a second. Find a squat position so your feet are shoulder width apart, toes slightly pointing out. Lower your weight down. As you lower your hips back and down, reach your weight out in front for a front raise. Press up, lower and reach. Beautiful. Four more just like that. Just bringing that weight up to shoulder height. Three. Abdominals drawing in and up. Last one, hold it down right here. Pulse it, eight, seven. Try to get low in that squat. Four, three, two, one. Bring it up. Press your weight overhead as you curtsy. Right foot crosses back. Good, chest press, squat. Curtsy, overhead press. Squat, chest press. This one will get the heart rate up. It's a nice combo for the arms and the legs. The last three, let's go. Two. One. Bring it up, switching sides, left foot crosses back. 
overhead press, curtsy. Press it into your squat. Good. Stay with it. Three more, let's go. Two. One. Bring it up, shake it out. Coming into that squat to front raise one more time. See shoulder width apart when you're ready. Lower down, reach your weight. Out, lift. Slow it down. Inhale, lower. Exhale, push back up. Nice. Three more. Last one. Bring it up. All right. Grab a sip of water and we're going to come right back into it. Go ahead and grab both weights now. Finding a lateral lunge with a chest fly into a reverse lunge with the twist. So when you're ready, stepping out with your left foot, lower the hips back and down with your chest fly, slight bend in the elbows. Bring your weights into your midline, that same foot is gonna step into a reverse lunge, twisting in the opposite direction of your leg. Lift back up when you're ready, left foot steps out, lateral lunge, chest fly. Left foot steps back, reverse lunge, twist to the right. Beautiful, let's go. There is no rush here. Focus on your form and a full range of motion through your movements. Halfway. Last two on this side. All right, we're gonna meet in our lunge here. Find your twist, bring it back center, lift up straight arms, straight legs. When you're ready, face your palms inward, hammer curl. Lower your back knee, lift, lower. And left, you're bringing your weights towards your shoulders, lift. Beautiful, four. Three. Woo. Last one. Hold it down, little pulse. Eight. Seven. Burn it out. Four. Three. Two. One. Lift up. We'll switch sides. This time stepping out with the right foot. Lateral lunge with your chest fly. Reverse lunge. Twisting over to the left. Beautiful. Good, breath in, step out. Exhale, lift. Halfway. Stay with it, last two. One more. Meet me in your lunge. Find your center, straighten your arms, straighten your legs. Full range lunge, hammer curl. Press up. Try not to swing those weights. Reverse the resist. The resistance in both directions. Three. Two. Last one. Hold it right there, pulse. Eight, seven, burn it out. Four, three, two, one. Lift it up. 
grab a sip of water. We are going to come down to the mat. All right, so keep one weight on your mat for a transfer with your push-ups. So place your weight behind your left wrist and then set up for a push-up position. From your push-up, I'll give you a modified option first. You'll lower all the way to your belly, drop down to your knees, press up, right hand to your weight, transfer it behind the right wrist. Lift back up off the knees, lower. Find your knees, press up, left hand to the weight, pass it right back over. All right, otherwise, keep up and off of your knees if you wish. Great work. Come on, one more. From here, lower to your knees. Press your hips back to your heels. Breath in. Breath out when you're ready. Find your push-up position. Tuck your toes, lift up and off of your knees. From here, one push-up, one transfer. Almost there. One more. All right, lower the knees, press the hips back. Go ahead and place that weight underneath your right hand and then open up to the side. Grab your other weight here for some sideline series. Full range motion, leg extension, lift, lower tap the floor. Again, resisting in both directions to make sure we're not using momentum. Navel pressing back to the spine. Your shoulders are open and away from your ears. Two more. One, hold it up, little tiny pulse. Eight, seven. Good, three, two, stay up and flex. Eight. Press up and out of that bottom palm. Three, two, one, little bend and lengthen. Just a one inch press. Three, two, one, hamstring curl, bend and lengthen. Try to keep your knee pressing open so it doesn't dip down. Almost there, come on. Three. Two. Last one, hold it in. Point your toe, lift, lift. Last little bit right here. Two, flex, eight. Woo, last four, three, two. One, lower down. Just bring your head from the front of the mat to the back of the mat. Fresh leg when you're ready. Getting it set up, pressing up and out of your bottom shoulder. Full range lift and lower tap. Pretty. Four. One, hold it, pulse it. Four, three, two, flex, eight, seven, four, bend and lengthen. Keep going. 
four. Stay up, we curl. Let your body shake if it wants to shake. You are getting stronger. Three. Last one. Hold it in bed, point your toe. Pulse up, eight, seven. Shoulders are open. Three, two, stay up, flex. Eight, seven, last few seconds. Four, three, two, one, lower down. From here, find your seat with your legs out in front of you. Let's take a quick figure four stretch. Cross your right ankle over your left knee. Catch your breath. Switching sides when you feel good there. Getting ready for some abdominals. We're gonna keep a full body though, so we're still working with our weights. Lower onto your back. Bring your legs into a tabletop position so your knees are over your hips. Bring your weights right over your shoulders. Half circle, curl your head, neck, and shoulders. Find boat pose, bicep curl. Lower down, tabletop, weights over shoulders. Circle, curl, hold. Lower. Again, no momentum here. Let those abdominals lift you up and lower you back down. Curl and lift. Beautiful. If it's too much to focus on the upper body, you can always drop the weight. Three. One, hold it up, tap, curl, tap, and curl. Beautiful job. Three, two, one, little twist. Bring your weights in to, to your midline. Go right, center, left, center. Slow. Right, center, left. Find those obliques. Two. One more each side. Good, lower back onto your back. Woo! Place one weight underneath your left heel and we'll set up for single leg bridge. All right. Placing your other weight in your left hand, right hand goes down by your side. When you're ready, lift up into your bridge. We'll lower chest press, lift with your bent leg, and then extend as you lower your arm and your leg, lift back up. Now, if you have any back issues, only lower your leg to about your opposite knee, and then just bring it right back up to midline. So lower, bridge, bent knee, chest press, lift up, straighten your leg, extend, lift. Beautiful. Breath in, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Three more on this side. One. Hold it up when you're ready. Pulse, eight, seven, four, Three, we hold up one, hold it right there. Five, four, 
three, two, one, lower down. Whoo! Place that weight underneath your right heel. Weight goes in the opposite hand. So left palm down by your side, right arm straight over your right shoulder. When you're ready, we'll lower it down into our bridge. Chest press with a bent leg. Lengthen your arm and leg, extend, lift back up. Lower, lift. So as your arm bends, your leg bends. As your arm lengthens, your leg lengthens. Arm and leg are doing the same thing. For that modification, feel free to only lower your leg to your opposite knee. Great work. Stay with me, you guys. We're almost done with this workout. One more. Hold up, pulse it. Let's go. Eight, seven, I'll burn it out. Four, three, hold it, one. Five, four, three, two, one. Lower down, hug your knees in towards your chest. Make little circles on your low back. Reverse direction. All right, drop both knees over to the right, gaze over your left shoulder for a twist. Take your time here. No rush to find the other side. Letting both knees fall over to the left as you gaze over your right shoulder. Finding center, roll up. We'll find a nice hamstring stretch. Lengthening out through your legs, biceps by your ears, sitting up nice and tall. Taking a big breath in as you exhale, hinging from your hips as you reach out towards your toes. You can always release your hands down to your shins. All right, you guys, lift up to a tall spine. Find a comfortable seat. Feel free to cool it down, stretch it out for as long as you need. Let's close it out, big breath in, reach your arms out and up. Palms touch at the top, exhale, drive your hands down to your heart space, pressing your thumbs against your beating heart. Letting gratitude wash over you for giving yourself the time and space to show up and move your body. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you enjoyed this workout and you want some more, leave a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, so you never miss a workout. Stay strong, take care of yourselves, and I will see you guys in the next one.